I'm meteorologist Nicole Mitchell with today's risk areas around the country. And one thing that we'll see as we look across the country today, kind of a contrast of temperatures above average on the West Coast and especially the northern part of the United States, well below average in Texas where we've had that rain and also below average on portions of the East Coast. So here's a look at kind of that some of that contrast that we're going to see. Uh, New York, D.C., 10, almost 15 degrees below average. Dallas and some other parts of Texas, close to 20, if not over 20 degrees below average. That's because of the cloud cover and moisture that we've had in that part of the country. So with those below average temperatures, especially on along the East Coast, one of our concerns going in from tonight into tomorrow morning, we actually have uh, some frost advisories and freeze warnings. So if you still have some of those plants outside or uh, growing vegetables, for example, you'll have to cover it up, bring it in, do whatever you can because that could be a dangerous situation for the plants into the overnight. Otherwise, we're just watching all that moisture that we're seeing in the midsection of the country. And so showers moving along. Doesn't look like any of that will be severe, but especially on the Texas side of this, where we've been really kind of waterlogged the last couple of days, watch for a couple more days of rain. And because of that risk, and here's what we have for the next seven days, but especially in Texas, it's still creating some of those flash flood potential areas. So do be careful of those.